For the meringue recipe, you will need two egg whites, a half cup of sugar, and a dash of cream of tartar. First, you'll separate the eggs um, and put the egg whites into the mixer. I separate eggs by hitting them on the counter, then using my thumbs to press in and separate the shells. Then I move the yolk from shell to shell as the white falls out of it. With your whisk attachment, beat the egg whites at full speed until you get stiff peaks. The egg whites will start to look like foam. The more it holds its shape, the stiffer the peak. Your peaks are stiff. Now add the sugar in slowly. A word about sugar. Um, many people like to use confectionate sugar over granulated because it dissolves better. And yes, I agree. However, when you cook it, I don't taste a big difference. It doesn't taste more grainier. I do taste a difference in the sweetness. Confectionate sugar is sweeter. So I would suggest putting in less confectionate sugar uh, in your recipe. Also, you could take the granulated sugar and grind it up in your food processor if you want to um, help dissolve it better in the meringue. Next up, cream of tartar. Just a ta dash, maybe a quarter teaspoon. You are now ready to put it on the baking sheet. You can either pipe it out, you can use a spoon and just put up out dollops. I am making one giant sheet cookie because I'm using it for a recipe that's an American version of Eaton's Mess. Go check out the recipe. Um, making it one giant sheet cookie just makes it a lot easier for me. All right. Set oven to 225 and cook for about two hours. Um, my giant cookie probably takes three hours and it's probably still soft in the center, but I eat it anyway.